Welcome to Weird Beer Wednesday. I'm Vic. This is my channel. Usually I have Travis, but he's out of town on work. For a couple of weeks, so it's just going to be me. I know you're disappointed. So am I. But anyway, I have a pretty good selection for this week. Travis is going to be mad that he missed this one, I'm pretty sure. I'll be right back. Let me get it. Did I get it yet? No. I'll be right back. One sec. Yingling. Hershey's chocolate porter. And anybody that knows me knows that I love chocolate. So, thanks Seth for the idea. I appreciate it. Anyway, I'll be right back. One second. Yingling, America's oldest brewery. Hershey's chocolate porter. I don't know what's up with it yet. I'm gonna let you know. There's not really very much information uh, for me to look at on the bottle or the six pack. Uh, it doesn't tell me uh, what the uh, alcohol content is uh, or anything like that, but you know, it's made in Pennsylvania. Uh, and this, this stuff is supposed to be incredible. So, uh, let's go ahead and pour some and see what happens. Twist off, really the first one we've had on the show. So, oh wow. Look how, look how incredibly dark that is. That is reminding me, it looks like Guinness, almost. Not quite the head of a Guinness, because a Guinness has a very special type type of head that they can pour little shamrocks in when Guinness is on tap and you're in the right Irish pub, if you know what I mean. Here's your beer porn, man. This stuff is looking good. Wow. I don't smell chocolate. It smells like beer. I'd ask Travis what he thought, but he's not here. Bummer. He's going to miss this, I'm telling you. I just have a feeling it's going to be incredible. So, what do you think, Travis? Well, I think you should crack one, Vic. Okay. Well, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to crack one, take a sip. Again, this is the first twist-offs we've had on the show. Almost all, you know, really... I don't really, maybe a slight scent of cocoa. Maybe a slight chocolate smell. Yeah, yeah okay, I, I can take that. Oh, holy shit. Incredible. Wow. Yingling. Hershey chocolate porter. Who would have thought? I gotta drink some more, you know me. Wow. 
That's some good stuff. Uh, America's oldest brewery, Yingling. Pottsville, Pennsylvania. I'm assuming it's not far from Hershey's because it wouldn't be that far of a jump. I don't know. Maybe. I'm wrong. I mean, I don't know. But I'm really digging it. Get some. I don't know. I, I totally like it. I don't hate it at all. Oh, my God. Family operation right there. Is that what that says? Family operation. Family operation, American owned, it says right across there. I don't know if you can see that, though, if it'll focus in. Right there. That's super cool, too. Yingling. Hershey's chocolate porter. I'm telling you, I'm not even through a one bottle, and I'm gonna highly recommend this stuff if you can find it. <laughs> if you can find it. Damn. I'll be right back. Normally I'd say I'm back for informational beer number two. I'm Vic and that's not Travis, because he's not here. I have no more information other than what I already told you. It's Yingling, Hershey's Chocolate Porter from Pottsville, Pennsylvania. And that's what it looks like. That's good shit. But I need more information. First sip out of the glass, I'll tell you right off, tasted very, very chocolatey. Man, I really dig that because as everybody knows, all my friends and stuff, I am a chocoholic. Although I try not to be, I try to be a good boy. <laughs> This is almost a wasted episode because this stuff is so good. I don't even think it needs advertising, but I'm going to do it anyway. Uh, I'm Vic. This is my channel. I drink beer so you don't have to. Now, you want to drink that. I'm telling you. Like, subscribe. Hit that little bell thingy. It's over here somewhere. I'm not sure. And you know, help out the channel. The travels will be back in two weeks. I think it's two weeks. Anyway, we're heading into the holidays, so I'm looking forward to some of these holiday Oktoberfest leftover brews that I can find. Because uh, that stuff's out there. And, uh, you know, if you got a suggestion, of course, leave it in a comment. I'll look for it. I'll buy it. Uh, I'll order it online if I have to. What do you think, Travis? Well, I'm not here, so I can't tell you what I think, but I think I like it. He would like it. You would like it, too. I highly recommend this stuff. If you let it sit in the glass for a minute, you can really smell the chocolate. Um, it is smooth, and it has that no aftertaste of beer whatsoever. It just tastes like uh, dark beer with chocolate. It's so good, oh my God. I 
I don't know what else to tell you. But I'm big. It's my channel. Like, subscribe. And I guess I'll see you next time. This beer is so good, I'm just going to go drink the rest of the damn six-pack by myself like a poor, lonely alcoholic without my best buddy. Anyway, <laughs> I appreciate you watching. We'll see you next week. Like and subscribe.